Hey, welcome back. This is Tom, and this is Tom's Radio Room Show. I love this little radio. I got it for like six ninety eight on sale at, I believe, Banggood or Gearbest. It's really been a handy little radio. Um, today, I just got this in yesterday, and I've been talking about it a couple of times on previous shows. This is the TIVDIO HR-11S, and if you saw my previous show, where I had the matrix of their radios. This thing has all kinds of capability. And this morning, I'm just going to do an intro, and I haven't even taken this out of the box. So we're just going to take a look at it real quickly. Um, it was shipped in just a plastic bag, and it got a little dent here on the uh, box. So hopefully that didn't hurt anything inside. But I like the packaging. This is a nice little box. Um, and it uh, slides out like this, well, like that, or there we go, it slides out like that. And um, here on this side tells you all the features. Now, quickly go over them. Again, I'm just kind of introducing you to this radio, and then we're going to do uh, several shows reviewing it. But here's some of the features. Hand crank, so you can charge it using a crank dyno. Solar powered. It has this little solar panel that you can charge it sitting in the sun. Emergency alert. I'm not sure exactly what that is, but we'll see. Uh, phone charger. So you can connect your phone to it, use the crank, charge your phone. Um, a flashlight. So this is an emergency radio, for one thing. Uh, DSP chip. That's the the chip for the radio itself, tuning and everything. Broadcast receiver, so it is a, it is a radio. Um, automatic tuning and storage. We've talked about that feature on many radios. Uh, this is one I didn't know about, 1,500 preset stations. Hmm, I don't know what that is. I'm assuming, I don't know, 1,500 preset stations. I wonder if they're AM, FM, and shortwave. And I think this radio has a long wave. Uh, that's, boy, that's got my curiosity up. Uh, Bluetooth interface, recorder, and according to what Angela, who sent me this radio to review, said was that it has a microphone, built-in microphone that you can record, and it will record off the radio. We'll have to see about that. Uh, music player. Sleep timer, alarm clock, lyrics display. Hmm. I'm, I was thinking when I saw the picture of this that this was similar to another radio by a different manufacturer, but I don't recall that other radio having these features. Uh, preset, uh, stations, lyrics display, I don't remember that. Anyway, uh, calendar, time, and date. Hmm. I wonder what that is. FM stereo. Well, that's nice. And hands-free phone operation, I guess, via Bluetooth. And it can, you can use the microphone in it to talk to your cell phone and vice versa. Use a speaker to hear yourself. So that's, um, that pretty well covers all the features. There's a picture of it. Now, once again... I didn't check the dimensions on the ad, so I'm not sure how big it is, but it could be small. <laughs> we will see here, both you and I will see here in a few seconds, like right now. Okay, here we go. Like, I love this packaging, although here's where it got jammed, so that's a shame. Okay, there it is. There's the radio, and it is smaller than I thought. And let's we'll see if I can get it out of here. Like I said, I haven't opened this yet, so this is all new. Uh, okay, down below here is the cell phone battery, which is kind of small. Let me see if it says on here what the capacity is. And <laughs> what it says, it's in English. There's Japanese or Chinese. Uh, 850 milliamp hours, 850. I think it was one radio in that line of radios that had a 1,000 
milliamp hours. And the next size down was the 800, which is this one. This is kind of small. It's kind of small. Okay. And then, of course, it depends on how much current the radio actually draws. So let's let's see. I don't think. Yeah. Let me see what's in this part here. How do I get it open? Oh, here, from the top. Oh, let's see. It's down in here. Okay, there is the manual. And uh, it's readable. I like I say it's too small print for me, but it's readable. So that's okay. Actually, she did send me the manual um, a couple of days ago before this arrived. Here's a little uh, dude boppy that you can carry around your wrist like that. Okay? I forgot what they call that, but it's one of these doodboppies. And here is the USB cable. It's quite short. Um, and But it's a standard, standard micro USB connector which you can get all kinds of cables that will meet that criteria and I have dozens so this one I think is going to be too short for me um, so I'm going to use one of my other cables so that's that that's all that's down there um, no headphones let me look at the back of this section see if anything is buried down under here it doesn't appear to be and there is nothing else so, we didn't get any earbuds, but that's not a big deal because typically the earbuds that come with these radios are not that good. <laughs> so, I don't mind missing it. It's kind of heavy for its size. Get it out of the bag here. So, there it is. Let me see if I can zoom in here. The display is pretty small. Um, let me um, dig out a ruler, see how small it is. It's in uh, da -da 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 -da. Uh, rulers upside down. I hate these rulers. They make upside down. Okay, it is just over an inch square. Square display. It's about an inch. Pretty small. I can see it's really heavy. It's probably the uh, dyno mechanism. So um, it's got, there's the hand crank right there. Now, Many of these radios, the hand crank feels a little flimsy. And it is, let me just try this one. Well, this is not too bad. Some of them are really hard to turn, and I'm always concerned about breaking this. And once you break this, that feature is gone out the door. Um, so we'll put this back down. And then and there's the solar panel. And we'll take the uh, little protection plastic off. Oh, there's the solar panel. Kind of, kind of small, but this is a small radio. Um, I'll be curious to see what kind of charging capability it has. Um, I don't want to talk about it too much because that's part of the review. Hmm. This is a, this is a full size, right there, a full size USB port. And it's got an on-off switch right above there, which I believe what that is for is when you want to use this as an output to charge your cell phone, you put it in a different position versus using it as an input to play MP3 players or WAV files or whatever. Construction looks pretty good. Oh, I like and like I say, I don't want to. Spend too much time on it. <coughs> Excuse me. I wonder if the battery. Oh, I got to put the battery in. Where? Oh, the battery goes down here. So let me do that. I just want to quickly, if there's any juice in the battery, turn it on to see what the display's like. That's all. That fits in there, nice and easy. Now it doesn't. Um, <coughs> excuse me. It doesn't have any AAA or AA battery compartments. So you have to use that cell phone or the dyno and of course if you don't have the battery in there you'll have to just keep cranking it to use it or you can probably hook it to a USB port 
and that will power it. So let's see if it'll turn on. Where is the on off button? Right here. Push and hold, and it does come on. Try to keep the glare down there. And there it the radio's on. And tuning is via uh, tuning is via I'm not sure. There's no tuning knob, and I don't see a button that is dedicated to tuning, but I'm assuming, depending on what your mode you're in, you use, because these are all, not all, but most of these have uh, multiple functions. These keys have multiple functions. Like this up here is marked volume up and down. But I guess this is tuning. Yeah, there's tuning. Okay, so let me turn it off. So this display is pretty bright. It's the blue display. It's not the green. I like the green. So that's about it. I just wanted to kind of introduce you to this. And like I say, oh, this is a pretty nice packaging they got. Unfortunately, the delivery service kind of dropped it. Hopefully, the radio doesn't have any uh, problems due to that drop. Um, see if the light will come on. Yeah, the lights on. There's the light, flashlight. So this is definitely an emergency radio. Has a flashlight, has um, cell, I mean solar cell charger and crank charger. And I don't think it has the weather band. Nope, doesn't have the weather band. So um, I'll learn how to use this, and we'll do a uh, couple reviews on it, and see how it goes. So if you enjoyed the show, please give me a thumbs up. That tells me whether I'm providing you shows of interest. I hate to do a show nobody cares about. And I probably have done a few of those. Have a great day. Bye-bye.